Letchworth Village. Letchworth Village was a mental hospital that opened in New York in 1911. Those that could work grew crops and tended to livestock. By 1921, the hospital was more of a work camp. A doctor at the facility suggested that they not accept those that couldn't work. In addition to farming, patients unloaded coal and built roads. Patients were divided into three categories, idiot, imbecile, or moron. There weren't enough nurses to maintain all the patients and they would often shovel food into their mouths to speed up the feeding process. Several patients choked to death in the 1920s. At this time, more than half the population of the hospital were children under the age of 16. There was evidence of malnutrition and neglect of the children living at the facility. The children were not offered any kind of education. Photos leaked in the 1940s showed patients that were dirty, naked, and crammed into a facility that couldn't accommodate them. By 1950, approximately 4,000 people lived in a facility built for just over 1,000. On February 26, 1950, the first live polio vaccine was administered. The patient was an eight-year-old resident of Letchworth. In 1972, Geraldo Rivera included the treatment of patients at Letchworth in his expose, Willowbrook, The Last Great Disgrace. The mental facility was shut down in 1996. Please visit www.icantbelieveitsnonfiction.com and don't forget to subscribe.